What's up, everybody? Damn here. In today's video, I found the package. And that boy. And that boy. <laughs> And so we got, got a package. We got a package. So I got my knife, obviously, and we gotta crack this thing open. So I wanted to record this part is because this is an uh, important moment. See me I'm right here. He's a little bit in the corner. You can barely see him. Let me move the camera. There we go. Okay. So I've been waiting for this for forever. Like I've been wanting this since it got revealed. Yeah. Like last summer. Yeah, yeah. About the and it's finally here. I ordered it. Don't, 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 don't. Cut it. Open. Let's open it. My first Deadpool action figure. Oh my gosh, I've been waiting this for days. I am so happy. We're gonna do a review about this later. Well, I'm gonna open this and I'm gonna talk about it later. Oh, oh my gosh. It's beautiful. Oh. So happy! I'm gonna play with this. I'll do a review later some other time. I'll talk about it later, but right now I don't play with this. I just want to show you that I got it. Oh, let's go! What's up, everybody? Diamond here. In today's video, um, I just showed you that clip from the beginning of the video. That was me opening a package that we'll get into later on in the video. But you saw it. You know what it is. Don't worry. I'll talk about it later. But for now, we're gonna be talking about my Christmas haul. Everything I got for Christmas of 2020. It was not bad at all. We get out some stuff um, I did not figure related, which is my channel usually based on now. I got a lot of figure stuff, and it's pretty cool. So, let me start out. So, I got two Nike sweaters. This one, and then that's a zip-up one, but it's black. Same thing, basically, just zip-up. I got new shoes. What else? Got little things like cologne. Uh shampoo little things nothing crazy uh and then let's get into the little crazy stuff i'll get into uh, some other stuff at the end that's not a figure related but for now that's what i got so let's start off with the figures so the first thing i got on christmas day or let's start off with the one you already know about mystique i got it for uh christmas eve was it christmas eve the day before christmas eve christmas eve eve yeah, that's what it was. Christmas Eve Eve. I got Mystique. You saw the video on. Uh, great figure. Like it a lot. It's just a, um, my opinion, I feel like people have been giving this uh, figure a little too much credit. A little too much credit. I guess they really base it off the sculpt, less the figure itself. I don't know what happened. I just heard something. Um, <laughs> I think, I think I heard something. Okay, one of my cats or dogs. Speaking of cats and dogs, um, I'm gonna do a uh, collection update soon. But my dog chewed up my Black Panther display. So I lost both of my Black Panther figures, Eric Killmonger and, to, and uh, the uh, Black Panther itself. So uh, yeah, I'm gonna have to be getting a new one very soon. Big rip, F and chat. But um. Yeah, I got some new figures to make up for that. Rather than the sneak, but I feel like people give this credit too much, uh, figure too much credit because just of oh, the sculpt. It looks great, don't get me wrong, I love the sculpt. But I feel like people have been giving it. <laughs> I say other figures, is there more? But this is a really great figure, and I really do like it. <coughs> Excuse me. And I'm really happy to have it. So, next figure, next figures I got on Christmas Day is the. Charles Xavier and Magneto two pack. I got him and him. Now, I didn't review do review the la, 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 la. I didn't review most of these figures because um I really wanted to mess up them on my own. I've been waiting for these figures all Christmas. Um the person who got it for me is really nice. Uh she's like the best. Her name is Simone. She's like an aunt to me. I love her a lot and her kid. Her kid's like my my son. He's, he's a little me. I, lo I like him a lot. Um, I love him a lot, and I love her a lot. If she, I know she's watching this. Thank you for the figures. Amazing. Um, starting off, they're great figures. I love the sculpt. I feel like they're little... To uh, I feel like they're meant mainly for the um, um, young figures, like starting with the Magneto. 
this is obviously uh, Days of Future Past with the young person, but I have the old person because I like them better. Nothing against the actors, but I just prefer the old people. Sounds weird. I prefer the original uh, Magneto and Charles Xavier. Uh, I love the sculpt. One problem about it is the um, arms. They don't move out. They, they just they, they can't move out because of the sculpt. It's just kind of whack. And then the Charlie Xavier. Nothing to write home about. Uh, plain figure. I love the accessory. I love the uh, hand and the. They're they're cool. You can use them for regular basic bodies like um, uh, civilians and backgrounds for uh, displays and crap. And they're really cool. Uh, the wheelchair is for the old man Logan to pack basically. I want to get that. <laughs> I'm gonna get that anytime soon. But they're meant for that. He doesn't come with the regular movie one. I wish he did. That would have been amazing. Download this figure a lot more. I do. I love it. But oh. great figure, solid figure. Obviously, honestly, really do like them. Yeah. Uh, next, I got on after Christmas, literally the day after the Saturday. I got, I went to Target and I picked up a Domino, De a Deadpool 2 Domino. Really solid figure. Now this is a better female figure. Now this is how you make a female figure. She's a lot better than the Do like the uh, Mystique. They're pretty similar, but I like this a lot more than this. I don't know why. I just like it. She's really cool. Like, look at this. Look at, the, look at that hula hoop. Could Mystique do that? Nope, not as good. But she comes with three accessories, or two Uzis, which I'll get a, a, do a little rant later, and then a pistol that I don't remember her using in the movie. It looks cool, but I honestly don't remember. I'm gonna have to rewatch it. But now, to the main event. Uh, talk about the figure in the beginning of the video, the Deadpool, to, the Deadpool movie. It's Deadpool 2. Deadpool 2, 2 pack, Megasonic Teenage Warhead, and Deadpool. Oh my gosh. I am winning these figures. Since they were announced, I wanted this, I wanted this, I wanted this Deadpool action figure so much. I just had a bad feeling that I wasn't gonna get it. And I got it. It's in my hand. It's mine. It, it, it's mine. I, I need to relax. This figure is amazing. I love the texture on the suit. I love the sculpt. One huge complaint. Is the guns? The guns. I still have the packaging. I haven't even taken it out because they're just so bad. Is it's a um, it's too comic booky. It's not realistic, which is weird because they've been doing this a lot with these figures to give her Uzis and they give Deadpool his deagles, but they're glued to his holsters. I was able to take this one out and it, they look great. I got them on camera. They look great. It just sucks that you can't use them. And I couldn't able to get the right one out because it's like really glued in there. So I can't. I'm gonna get the single carded one. It's the uh, race suit, basically the X Force one. I'm gonna have to get that. This figure is amazing. I love the little unicorn it came with. Really funny. And the Negasonic Teenage Warhead. I love the sculpt. I feel like they tried a lot on the top part and they kind of gave up on <laughs> the body because those aren't real boots. This doesn't have the texture like in the movie. Not even the waist. Uh, this... It feels smooth but it looks like it has texture. It's weird. Uh, the head is really cool. But I feel like mine is like looking off in two different directions. Can't really see because this lighting sucks. Okay, so um, what Raffel. happened here is that my camera fell behind like a uh, Joker poster, and um, is falling. yeah, it goes on for a while. But I was trying to say, like, I feel like the uh, figure, like itself, like the face, was looking in two different yeah. directions. Okay. Oh, there I am. <laughs> so I'll back. A lot just happened. Okay, so yeah, overall, a really good haul. Oh, <laughs> I almost forgot about this one. This is a little statue my grandma got me of Ultron. I'm using it on my MCU display. It's not really MCU, but it looks cool and I 
like I'm not gonna put it on there. I need more villains. I need another Ultron. I'm gonna get the movie one, and then I'm gonna use this. I'm still gonna use this as like an Ultron. Speak at like 100 miles per second. I'm gonna use this one as an Ultron bot when I get my official Ultron. Cause I do love the display. A little damage Captain America shield and Mjolnir. Kind of hinting towards that game. And uh, the tentacles are kind of annoying, but yeah, like crazy. Do love the figure, love the red, but I wish I had it more like a wash, you know. Overall, a great haul. Oh, I'm gonna do a quick pan of all the figures I got, and then I'm gonna do a little overall summary. Here's all the figures I got for Christmas 2020. Overall, great bunch. I do love my little X-Men display, and I will do a uh, uh, display video. We just play it. Very soon. And that was my collection of 2020. Hope you liked the video. Like, share, subscribe. The last thing I want to show you is I got a Nintendo Switch. This is actually really cool. I got this for uh, Christmas Day, or Christmas Eve, kind of. We wait a little bit. We do it at like midnight, but we do it really early because we can't wait. I got Nintendo Switch. Me. That boy, that woman, and that girl all got Nintendo Switches. Really cool. So, Merry Christmas, Happy New Year. Like the video. Like what it says right here.